Livingston County, WWJ, major traffic issues are expected to hang around for days on I-96 near Brighton after a flatbed truck carrying a crane hit an overpass Wednesday evening. Pleasant Valley Road remains closed over I-96 and traffic is getting by on the freeway's left shoulder, and officials say it's going to remain that way for a while. I-96 eastbound at Pleasant Valley Road, scene of truck overpass accident. No known injuries, but bridge damage. Updates at WWJ950 at which traffic pick.twitter.com 50fxkw60b2. John Hewitt, at John Hewitt Wish, September 27, 2017. Alert, Eb I-96 closed at Pleasant Valley Road in Livingston Company due to bridge hit. Alt routes advised. At mdota2https colon slash slash t dot co slash pubucrypspick.twitter.com slutmzooms. Michigan DOT, at Michigan and it, September 27, 2017. A truck with some kind of high equipment, a cherry picker, some kind of equipment with a boom raised did hit the bridge overpass on eastbound I-96 and damaged several of the beams, so we currently have our engineers on site to access that and see when it's safe to reopen, said Michigan Department of Transportation spokesperson Kari Arend. Drivers are urged to avoid the area and take an alternate route along US-23 or M-14. Normally we have three lanes out there, so the three travel lanes are closed, but to alleviate some of that traffic we are opening up the shoulder, said Arend. Just after 10 p.m. Wednesday MDOT tweeted that the bridge has to come down immediately. Heads up at 96, east of US 23, Pleasant Valley Bridge has to come down ASAP. No ADA on reopening at 96. HTTPS colon slash slash t dot co slash with capj. MDOT, Metro Detroit, at MDOT Metro Redet, September 28, 2017. Tom Simpson, an MDOT maintenance coordinator, said the hauler was carrying a high load and the impact of the collision damaged four steel I-beams. We're going to have to tear down the bridge tomorrow, Thursday, night, tentatively, he said. We'll keep the left shoulder open overnight and through tomorrow, then tomorrow night close eastbound I-96. Officials say there is no time frame for a reopening.